Hey everybody, back to school season is officially underway in San Bernardino County this morning. It's always such a big day, you know? <laughs> Students at Alta Loma High School reported to campus this morning for the first day of classes. Chelsea Edwards is there with more. They got a really big welcome there. Yeah, certainly a lot bigger than any welcomes I had in high school. <laughs> Definitely boisterous. It was warm. Yeah, really well done here. A lot of the kids that we spoke to this morning, they had those mixed emotions. I think we all remember feeling going back to high school and kind of nervous about the year ahead. You're excited about what could be coming up. And then also very tired, very sad that the summer break is officially over. But these kids, again, they were greeted with a very warm welcome. They had cheerleaders, members of the marching band who were here, greeting them as they walked in through the doors for the first time for the school year. Year. Now, Alta Loma High, where we are, it's one of eight comprehensive high schools in this district, and this is the second largest high school district in the state of California. Some 24,000 students from Ontario, Montclair, Rancho Cucamonga, also portions of Fontana, Upland, Chino, and Mount Baldy. Now, the final bell just rang at 8.30, but again, these students got a very warm welcome ahead of that. You've got cheerleaders and student representatives. They're getting ready for a rally to kick things off. Listen here. It feels kind of nerve-wracking and just I'm excited to meet like new people and see who's in my new classes. It's great. First day of school, like it's kind of nerve-wracking, but I'm excited. I'm very excited to like see new people and just help people around the campus and to just like go into the school year and try to do better than last year. Uh, we spoke to the principal as well. He reminded us that the graduating seniors this year, they started their high school careers during COVID. So while last year was an official first year fully back, this is kind of their, their last and first year fully being back at high school in their normal capacities. Now, most of the California high schools or schools in general head back to class next week. Some, though, have already started. For instance, San Bernardino City School District, they went back on July 31st. Now, the principal said, while it may seem early for people in our generation, we see to, I remember going back after Labor Day, typically. Uh, he says these kids have actually been doing this their entire educational careers. Many of them started in early elementary school so that they could get out a little bit earlier in the summer. So this is something that they're used to, even though it does seem early to a lot of us, August 9th, going back to school. Uh, sounds like it's shaping up to be a great day, though. We'll certainly keep you posted. Reporting live from Alta Loma, I'm Chelsea Edwards. I'll send it back to you guys. Have a welcome. This Thank you, Chelsea. Out there. Go, great go. welcome into the community. Go back to school.